All right, guys, happy 4th of July weekend. This is awesome. We have actually a very crispy day. Uh, not humid. Uh, it is an absolutely crisp day. Feels like a fall day for sure. Uh, appreciate you guys watching. We're going to put fish in the boat. And uh, I'll tell you what I'm going to do today. I'm definitely going to be trying out that new asteroid from Snipe and Braid again. That thing is hot. We're going to be using the Hammer 10. Greatest 10-footer on the planet, I think. And uh, we might even throw the... the, the the king's tail in there but i'll tell you we're gonna go to the far back end of this lake see what the kind of bite is there if it's changed a little bit there maybe and uh, the water temperatures are definitely cooling off a little bit and that's i think was gonna definitely add to a more aggressive bite let's do this yeah we're just gonna go right to the king's tail and a hair jig we're gonna see if that makes a difference no messing around today. Right off the bat. Good night. And there's our first fish. And they did not hesitate on that white hair jig, guys. Look at that nice little pile right there. We're going to go after some more of those guys. With the king's tail, even. One. Fish fry, fish fry, fish fry. Here we go. Another good slab in the boat right there, guys. I went with the stealth, switched it up. Went back to the hammer 10, just to give me a little bit more leverage and went back to that asteroid sniping braid and that is an awesome fish. small little guy a little eater we'll take it all right guys one of the things i want to talk to you guys about today was monitors i've been doing videos on monitors a lot lately with the tiktok channel and what i have on my boat is what's called an 8600 series so check it out right here guys that's an 8600 series now the reason why i went with an 8600 series is because they offer it in a 16 inch i believe they even offered it maybe a 22 inch monitor size um all of these monitors are available at PTG, but I went with the largest monitor. I'm always emphasizing go with the largest monitor you possibly can afford, uh, regardless of the quality. The processor, the screen, the pixels, everything on the 8600 series is top of the line. You can't get a better picture. Um, but to be honest with you, as a person that maybe, maybe you only fish on the weekends, maybe you only fish once, twice a week, um, I believe that Ultra Series uh, the 126 in particular because it's a 12 inch screen is your best bang for your buck so it's it's important the the ultra series so you guys can check all those units out over there at PTG they've got an assortment of them it's really easy great customer service um, so yeah that's what I use an 8600 series now if you want to talk in terms of mounts I'm a cornfield fishing gear uh, pro staffer I think they're fantastic I think their customer service is second to none. Uh, you will absolutely love Mark because the guy just takes care of you and does a lot of custom things. If you look down here, even on my boat here, a lot of customization up to the bridge to accommodate a bass cat. And he can do those types of things for you. So I'd give him a shout. So PTG, Cornfield Fishing Gear, awesome. So we're gonna continue casting, we're casting. We're in the back of the lake now. Uh, a lot of calm water and which means we stay back. We stay as far back as possible because those fish will sniff you out. They know you're there, um, especially in the clarity of water that I that I typically fish. But we're putting the stealth mode. That sniping braid is awesome. That asteroid is awesome. That gold head is just on fire. I'm telling you right now. Another good fish. Bam. Now guys, I wanted to show you guys what I've got in my boat. That's kind of how I prep for a day. Right now I have three hammers. I know there's only two there. One's up there near the, uh, the trolling motor right now. I got the king's tail right there. And then I've got the Maverick over there. So I'm loaded up 
with just about everything I could possibly do in regards to being prepped for these fish and you know all the different techniques that we use. Check out the gold on the Maverick right there. That's a hot rod, that's that six footer. Um, but yeah, that's, that's how I come prepped to the lake. I also always bring, oh, let me see here. Let's go fishing pack here. These are the hair jigs, 45 of them for 49 bucks. You can't beat that deal. But anyway, I got those there. I use those as well. Um, right now, the bite's been on a paddle tail, so I've been using that, but uh, I still throw a hair jig from time to time just to see when it comes back, because I know that profile's a big, a big factor. What else can I show you guys? Yeah, so coming prepared for different things you're gonna be doing all day, very, very critical in my, my opinion, putting fish in the boat, and that's what we're doing right now. Um, yeah, let's just go back, but look, awesome. That's the setup, that's what I've got going on in my boat and how uh, we try to put as many fish in the boat. Now, hammer tin right up there, bam. Come on now, don't get much better than that. I am liking that asteroid. I'm gonna keep telling you guys that because, yeah, I, you know, on a fickle bite, which is what we're going through right now in my home leg, uh, I feel pretty, pretty comfortable. I'm throwing everything I can at them, basically. So, there you go. Also, I wanted to talk about you, the, the guide trips. I keep forgetting to bring up the guide trips. We've had an incredible record year in terms of guide trips. Um, we do have availability, of course, in the fall. I highly recommend coming out, guys. Um, we put a ton of fish in the boat, and uh, we're so far ahead of schedule, we're kind of taking a little bit of a break. But if you did call and you wanted to do something in the September, November, or July months, you certainly... Um, can uh, reach out to me at 3poundfishing at gmail.com. This is a really good pile. Again, staying back, got a nice little wind. And when we get it down there, we kind of jump it around there, trying to get some attention. And when they go back around like that, they just go right away from me. Good fish. Whew. That is a slay, baby. That's one of the day. Anyway, guys, I'm gonna wish you guys a happy 4th of July weekend, but that is a freaking awesome fish right there. Check out the, uh, the asteroid. Can't say enough good things about that right now. Um, also, check out the Let's Go Fishing Packs. Yeah, 45 hair jigs for $49. You gonna put some slabs in the boat? That was awesome. Take it easy, guys.